Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today it is Friday. It's actually Friday the 13th, I've just realised. So that's a good start. As you can probably see by the title, this vlog is going to be Come to Centre Parks with us. We are heading there later on today for the weekend for three nights. And by we, I mean me, my mum, my dad, my sisters, and the boys. When I say the boys, I mean our partners, <laughs> because there's three girls. Obviously, I've got two sisters. I just say the boys, because it's just easier. You know, one of my sisters has got a husband, one's got a fiance, and I've got a boyfriend. So I just say the boys. But anyways, um, yeah, that is the plan for today's video. I'm so excited. We have a few things planned for Centre Parks, but I think mostly we're just gonna go with the flow. Um, we're gonna take the dogs as well. So Buddy and Bailey are gonna come. They're gonna love it. I think Bailey's actually been before. She's a spoiled dog. Buddy might have been before as well, actually. I don't know. Yeah, I'm just getting sorted now. It's actually currently half past one. I think we're planning to leave around half two, hopefully. But my boyfriend has to drive to me first um, so that we can get in one car. So he should be here soon. But I've just been packing this morning. I forget how long packing takes, honestly. I just, I'm such an overpacker. I'll show you how much stuff I have in a sec. And because we're gonna like cook a couple of nights as well, I'm even gonna bring my air fryer. I know that sounds like quite extra. I mean, I'm literally just gonna chuck it in the car and then you park right outside your cabin or house or whatever whatever it is um and then i'll just take it in so actually it's not like i'm lugging it around like on a train or anything it should be pretty simple it's just loading the car sometimes takes a while as well because you have to bring everything up and down the stairs i thought i would just intro the vlog because i don't know how hectic it might get later i think we're gonna do like a games night we've actually all been before but i don't think my boyfriend's ever been um and i've tried to like explain a few parts but he's like no don't spoil it like i want it to be a surprise i hope you guys enjoy this vlog i'm so excited for it. Centre Parks was actually my birthday present from my sisters and I think my parents as well but it's from two years ago and we've only just got around to booking it because since Covid it got so like booked up and then we had other things going on and now we're finally going but it's actually my mum's birthday this weekend so we're obviously going to celebrate that as well. I did go to Charlotte's last night and we baked a cake to take um, for my mum's birthday. I'll insert the little uh, video that I've I like to be educated But I'm so frustrated Hello to my loneliness I guess that ignorance is bliss Take me back to be Here's the air fryer. <laughs> this is my mum's present or part of it because my sisters have the other half. I got this from Amazon and I actually thought it was really good. So it's like 15 pounds. I don't even think it says what's inside, but you get so much. So you get a whole um, blue notch. Obviously you've got to build it yourself, but you get enough balloons to make that. I don't think we're going to actually do a blue notch, but we're just going to blow up as many balloons as we can and just sprinkle them around to decorate. Um, also, it's going to be a challenge to try and do this without her seeing, um, but we'll try our best. And then you get like a mini happy birthday balloon banner thing that you can do. You get like a sequin wool, obviously most of it is reusable as well. Um, a tablecloth, some other balloons, some extra, extra added um, little decorations. And then this is a bag of stuff. I've just chucked a hoodie and Ed's hat on top because he left it here. Just got some drinks that I had in the fridge and some food that's gonna go out of date because yeah, basically moving away for the weekend. So I even brought my little coffee frother, my oat milk and some like snacky bits as well. On the way we are actually gonna head to Tesco and get some more food because we're gonna cook tonight. Um, I think we're gonna make like gyros. 
chicken gyros. I've posted that on my story a couple of times, but I can definitely do like a whole recipe video on my um, home Instagram if you guys are interested because it is so yum. But yeah, we need to get all the ingredients for that. And then in here, um, this is just an extra bag that I have. So I've got my makeup, um, three pairs of shoes because we're gonna go out for dinner one night so I wanted nice boots. I've got some slippers for the house and then some trainers under there somewhere. This is all like deodorant, skincare, hairspray, like a ring light and stuff, my Polaroid. I've actually left my flat in a nice tidy state as well. Um, I've changed my bedding this morning so I've been pretty organized. And then through here, I need to hang out another wash in a second but this is my case so far. So this is just like mainly clothes. I need a swimming costume as well. So I've packed two in case, you know, this is where I overpack. I don't need to, but I'm just gonna bring two just in case. Yeah, I need to somehow zip this suitcase up. And that I think is pretty much everything. No doubt I'll probably end up packing some more bits before we leave because I just panic and I like to have options, to be fair. I've literally just seen a scarf that I'm probably gonna pack. Oh my God, also actually, I might as well include in this vlog. I got something really exciting that I wanna show you guys. Um, it's something that I've really wanted for a long time and will actually come in so handy for me personally. I wanted to get myself an iPad and I finally bit the bullet. These are obviously really expensive um, and I wanted to make sure that I was definitely gonna use it and I wanted to research and make sure that I got the right one and stuff. So anyway, I finally got one and this is the latest one. I don't actually know if you can go back and get old models, but I just thought let's go with the latest one and then hopefully this should last me a really long time. So I actually got the biggest size. People might be like, why if you've already got a laptop? Like they're pretty much the same screen size. But I love working um, on a big screen. Like even my phone is a iPhone Max. And some people are like, how? Like that's so big, it's like an iPad. <laughs> but because I'm looking at screens all the time, if it's really tiny, it really, really hurts my eyes. The bigger the screen, the better, basically. And this is what it looks like. I've been playing around with it this morning and I love it so much. I've also got the pen because for things like thumbnails, editing, writing things down, I love to do it quite literally. And that's what makes it different from a, from a laptop in my opinion. So I definitely wanted to get the pen and I definitely want to use this for obviously work mainly, but to get a little bit creative as well. So I'm gonna have a play around with some apps and stuff and then I can obviously let you guys know what I'm really enjoying. I also couldn't resist um, getting it engraved because I didn't realize that engraving your products on Apple is free. So I was like, why would I not do that? Like if it was added money, I was never fussed about it. But because it was literally like, engrave your products for free. And I was like, well, how can I say no? That's what I did. And let me show you how cute it is. And also it doesn't affect, like if, if I, for some reason got this and then wanted to send it back, you can send it back, even if it has the engraving. So I was like, there's nothing stopping me. Um, so this is what I went for. Hopefully you'll be able to see. You can add like little emojis. Honestly, I was so torn between what I wanted to get. I <laughs> could probably see your reflection. Um, so I got L with a little star. And then I also got it on the pen. And also if I then ever, I'm in the same room with somebody who has the same product, I'll know which one's mine. So it's actually pretty practical as well. Yeah, I love it so much. I think I am gonna bring it this weekend. Obviously I'm probably not gonna sit on it and do things because we're gonna be busy. Um, but if I get a spare minute, I might carry on setting some things up and I know that my family will be interested in it because I have mentioned that I might get one. So also the case I got on Apple as well. And I had to order the case straight away because I was like, there's absolutely no way that I'm gonna take this iPad anywhere until it has a case. Yeah, I wanted to show you my new little purchase. Just got here. Perfect, lovely. thank you thank so you. much. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> Have a lovely weekend. Thank, thank you, you so much, bye. bye. Thank you, Sandra. We made it. And I'm filming on my phone because my camera's in the back with lots of bags. How excited are you? We are here. This is the kitchen. We're currently cooking, making the bread for the gyros, prepping. It's all going on. Need to make some more. Zoe and Ned are just about to arrive. Charlotte and Ned are here. Got the fire going. Do a little, little tour. So, 
It's got a bedroom here. I think Zoe and Ed are gonna have this one. Me and Micah are in this one. Need to pack, unpack all of our stuff, but we have them. Oh, nice bathroom. Lovely big mirror. Toilet rolls, I don't actually know if we had to bring those, but yeah, toilet rolls. Got this big open space. I wrote our itinerary on this blackboard. A couple more bedrooms, mum and dad's. Charlotte and Ellis's. Ellis has brought his washing to hang out. And we've got another bathroom. So that is the house, love it. Got my wine. brought my air fryer <laughs> I think I mentioned that actually but I'm so glad I did the chicken's cooking away just need to cook the chicken and the flatbreads Mike has made nachos everything is looking good hello gorgeous girl hello Good morning, it is now Saturday the 14th of January. We've all been up for a few hours, it's half past 10. We've all had showers and we're just in active wear because we're gonna go play some sports today. The boys are, well, all had showers apart from you. Get in the shower. The boys have actually got a squash booked at 11 and I think the girls are gonna try and get a badminton court. They do usually get quite booked up but we're gonna try our best. Just been chilling and we're just about to have some breakfast. I'm just gonna have some strawberries and this little cereal snack bar. This is just a five of one bar, fake one from Aldi. It's a little bit rainy today. Um, you can see it a little bit more now. We're like in the middle of the forest and we're so excited to have a little explore. And we played some games as well. We played Would I Lie To You last night. Such a good game, so funny. And we were up to like one and yeah, excited for a good day. Do you want to say hi to my vlog? Yeah, no, good that you know, side of it. Ah, oh, rude. It's squash the competition now. You ready for squash the competition? Not squash. Ed and Dad have actually been for a run as well today. Quite impressive. Ed is running the marathon this year, so if anybody wants to donate, I will leave his link in my description. Go on. It's for Concern Worldwide. Uh, they do lots of famine, flood, war relief. They help people all around the globe. Uh, if anyone has some spare pennies, it's going to go strict to them. Lovely! Well done! And also there was just a drama about my iPad charger because I forgot it and it died and I was really upset because everyone's been loving it. It's so much fun. Um, but my mum brought one because mums do bring everything. She saved the day. We are just walking to the plaza. Oh, oh there's a car. They have bigger houses there as well. Me and Rob had saw this all when we were running earlier. Oh! Oh, I've got no makeup on because we're getting all sweaty probably, but it's going to be a wholesome weekend with not a lot of makeup. We're here! <laughs> Rumour has it there's a Starbucks here. Ah, <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> personal in here.
I don't know if there's anywhere I can set you up. Right, lower. They're doing around the world. I mean, that is probably about the last 10 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> this is a boxing day. Look at the doggies! Hayley! Hello, gorgeous! We have just got to the pool. Obviously, I can't really film anything here because I'm going to be in the pool on the rapids. Let me have my phone. This weekend's been so nice to detox in so far. Um, but yeah, we just got here. Just going to get into my cozy. This is from Gymshark, by the way. I love this swimming costume. Oh, right, yeah. It's almost like a bikini, but it's not. Um, so yeah, see you after. Okay, we are back from the swimming pool. Like I said, I can't really film in there because I'm not going to take my camera around the water park. Wish there was somewhere to like prop you guys up in here. But we're back in the bedroom. I'm in the lodge. I'm in, I'm in the bedroom. And I'm going to get changed for dinner. I've just done my makeup. I've just done a really simple glam. There's not like great light in here, but I sort of just did it to the ceiling light. And hopefully it actually looks all right. <laughs> um first time I've put makeup on in a few days but yeah I'm just about to get dressed I just washed my hair as well and I can't really be bothered to dry it so I think I might just slick it back I don't really know I think I might oh good little glow there I might part it and then like do like a bun I don't know but I'm gonna put on my grey skims dress um, it's just so comfortable and quite flattering and just easy. Just quite nice chilled outfit. I don't actually know where it is. I did bring it right. You? I thought I forgot it then. This is the Skims. I don't actually know what one it's called. I want to say Limitless. I think that's wrong. I don't know. But anyway, I'm going to chuck it on and then I'll show you what it looks like on. Okay, just got dressed. This is my Skims outfit, outfit, dress, and then I've just popped on my ASOS boots as well. I actually love these together. Um, just looks really cute and they're really comfy. I'll chuck on a coat as well, but this is my outfit of the night and we're actually going to the Indian restaurant, which I'm so excited about because we've been so active today. Um, I've actually worn my Apple Watch and hit all of my goals as well. So yeah, I feel really good because it's almost been like a detox weekend as well. We've been really active and I'm actually really hungry for dinner, which is, yeah, it's really nice. And someone messaged me saying, this is the best Indian restaurant that they've ever been to. So, we will see but yeah we're about to go there now also in this bag is some presents for my mum because it's her birthday tomorrow so we can set up for that in the morning um so yeah i'm trying to hide this for now but 
Very excited to set this up as well, but also, I think the boys are gonna try and sneak the cake into the restaurant somehow, so yeah, we'll see. See you there. Hey. Charlie looks really good. Oh, oh, yours looks delicious. Mm. How was your dinner? Birthday to you. Happy birthday to you, Karen. Happy birthday to you. Yeah, she does. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Guess the flavour. Guess the flavour. Coffee. No. Coffee. Coffee. It's definitely coffee. Espresso. Espresso martini. It is espresso martini. Well, it's coffee cake. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, panic over. I just dropped the camera, but it was an accident. How was everybody's dinner? Yeah. Dinner was lovely, and we're just heading back to the lodge now. We're gonna have some more games and actually have some of the cake um, <laughs> because we're a bit stuffed from dinner, but it was delicious. Cake holder. Good cake boy. Cool person. <laughs> it's currently. <coughs> About what time? Like midnight? Half eleven. Oh, it's only half eleven on Saturday. And I've got my retainer in, by the way. If I'm talking funny, can't be that funny. Everyone's just gone to bed, <laughs> and I just checked outside um, that everyone's gone to bed and all the lights are on, off and stuff. So we're gonna start blowing up some balloons Is that in what we're doing? here. Yeah, just like getting everything oh, out. Well, my mum and dad's door is open, so they'll, like, we can't be loud. Anyway, I thought I could just do a little time lapse of us um, blowing up some balloons. You're going to help me? <laughs> I'm not going to make an arch or anything. I'm just going to blow up balloons. an arch? Oh. Balloon arch. Yeah. So we have a foil, oh my God, it looks hard foil fringe curtain. I'll probably just try and do that. All this stuff is so loud, though. Tablecloth, that'll be good. Wow, these are all the balloons. They actually come with a balloon pump. So but, loud. Yeah, but it's fine. Let's see if this works. Why are you doing that for Because I'm sure. But what? I love it. How good it is. Really good. What? Really good. Okay. Okay. First one. Down. Up to the hotel lobby. Me, I go through underground garages, presidential suite on the up in my phone. What numbers do I still have? Who do I Oh, Good lungs. find the strings that's why they're all on the table they should be hanging up somewhere but lost the string good morning happy sunday it is mom's birthday happy birthday mom it's just the girlies we're just going to the spa me and mom are having a massage charlotte's having and zoe's having she's just going to the spa but apparently this spa is beautiful so i'm really excited to see it probably won't be able to film but I'm sure it'll be lovely. Try and insert some photos if not. Um, 
Yeah, it's a bit nippy, but we're just walking there now. Have you had a nice birthday so far, Mum? There was no getting away from it. Very noisy. Because, yeah, anyway, but, yeah, welcome to the spa. I mean, it is your birthday, Mum. Yeah, birthday girl. Birthday girl's winning at bowling. Oh my god, I look so bad. Oh, you got one more than me. <laughs> Why is it so hard for? Why is it so hard? Up for you guys, Zoe. Oh. So rough Ready the job? last few days. They're mine. We're packing up to go. So sad. But it's okay. I think we're gonna grab some brekkie before we leave. This reminds me of like when we used to go to Cornwall, Mum, and we used to all pack up and you used to vlog and do you remember you used to vlog yeah. our holidays? I suppose it was vlog. You'd be making like packed lunches and stuff for us to all go out. Everything's getting packed away. God, we have a lot of stuff. Mm. <laughs> Buddy! Like She's can. getting comfy. <laughs> she actually is getting comfy. Is Ooh, that good? Is that, nice? that comfy? You can lean on the boot. Buddy's like, I've not got much room over here. <laughs> loads of the room. Lie down, buddy. <laughs> Bye, gorgeous girl. Have you had a good holiday? <laughs> What's wrong? Is it really <laughs> good? Tomato Avocado with tomato, pumpkin seeds and a, and a sausage. Egg or Looks really nice. Vinegar what is that? Yeah. Tomato soup. <laughs> <laughs> sat outside for the dogs. It's pissed. You wouldn't survive in the world, mate. You would not survive this cushion. Really nice. <laughs> well done, sat, sat <laughs> tomato, yeah, do you want some? <laughs> been everybody's peak and pits of the trip. Filthy animal. Filthy um, animal. Peak best pit worst. I actually really enjoy the badminton. Yeah, I like the badminton. Yeah. What was your pit? Yeah. Lovely. Yeah. That was the other bit because we all got involved. Yeah. I like Riz. Yeah, I like Riz. Yeah. I really enjoyed Riz. I did. No, I did. But my pit was. Mum, what was your peak and pit? What was your pit? When Ed had to leave, I didn't do any. Oh, my pit was when we lost Bailey the first day. When we got here. <laughs> lost <laughs> Bailey? Yeah, she ran out of yeah, the lodge. You literally wandered out of that garden. Yeah, but I thought, oh, God. Playing with the deers. I've had a lovely weekend. Dad, what was oh, your really? peak and pit? Squash. Football. What, oh, what, which one? <laughs> what was your pit? Oh, my pit. Uh, I'm getting up every morning to take a dog's <laughs> My pig and pit? Spending it here. It was first night playing games, which was really fun. Yeah. And we had the whole weekend with it, boss. My pig is that I realised how good I am at reading people. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you had a really good game too. You've got much better at games. What was your pit? Dad waking me up. I just love how active the holiday Yeah, my peak was that I don't feel rubbish after the weekend. We've done loads of sports. What do you like about this holiday? We've done things that we don't usually do, like badminton, table tennis, the rapids were fun. The rapids? Yeah, the rapids. Oh yeah, the rapids. And the pit was when we lost Ellis in the pool. Playing on my iPad was peak too. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>